Do you ever look at your piece and feel like... Then this video is for you! To brush up your memory on the basics, we have the time signature, which determines how many notes should be in the measure, the key signature, which is determined by the accidentals. The clef. The tempo and dynamics. The bar lines, which are used to separate measures. The staff, where you can find your notes. The repeat signs, meaning that the section within it should be repeated. And lastly, the double bar line, which signifies the end of a piece. Most common ones would be the staccato, the fermata, and the accent. The staccato means that you should sing the note shorter than its actual count. The fermata means that you should sing the note longer than its actual count. Lastly, we have the accent, which means that you should sing the note with more emphasis than usual. Unlike ikaw, the single. The two note relationships are the tie and the slur. The tie consists of notes with the same pitch, while the slur consists of notes that are different pitches. Wag pakabit kabit sa iba katulad ng slur. Be loyal like the tie! Okay, so I forgot to record an outro, but thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned something, and see you guys next time. Bye!